morning fellow collectors we are doing something a little different today today we drove about an hour out into Missouri Yay. to an outlet mall this place has got Toys R Us it's got Hot Disney Topic. Hot Topic everything outlet mall so we're gonna check this out and see what the dealio is and then we got another mall that's not too far from here was the main reason why we were coming here because they have a store called V Stock. There's a few of them around the area. The one that we're going to, the Chesterfield, it's a two story store that has like comic books and movies on the first floor, and then the second floor is like all action figures and games and stuff. Literally, favorite store in the world. <laughs> so, we're gonna go there. We're kind of celebrating my birthday this weekend since last weekend we were traveling and back home so Katie and I are doing the birthday thing this day so let's see what these guys got but first I'm gonna eat cheese fries buffalo wing wrap that was a Santa Fe chicken wrap mmm look at that that looks good there no 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 the only reason why we actually end up eating there. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're going to eat and then we'll go shopping for toys. Guess where we're going. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. Big. Come here. Come So, whew, that's saved me. I already got the Falcon. <clears throat> and I guess what the price I paid for it. Pay something like this. Anna. Oh, do you want princess? Are you a pretty, pretty princess? <laughs> Ow! He's falling asleep. He fell asleep. Hey, wake up. <laughs> He's just not happy. Yeah, he's not happy. Oh, electronic BB-8. Off. So they're going to make a huge helmet for $5.99. Guess who's coming home with me? Series. I mean, they get them, get him too. <laughs> I'm already getting days and share it. Because of course, I you can't find him room. in the Black Series. I haven't wanted him in Black Series, but I can't find him. Sure. You Man, he, did, yeah, he doesn't even. Dang it! Here we go again. Door. So I'm getting a helmet and these three figures so far. If I was smart, I would run out now. But. 
I'm pretty stupid, so I'm probably gonna be staying here a little bit long. Let's see if they got any cool figures back in here. Oh, it's only three dollars too. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. Looking for the pizza pan. There he is. This is ten dollars. Oh. I'm. I want to go here. Alright, so we got all this stuff. And we got a $12 cooler bag. So when we go back and forth to Indiana, it's all this. And there's only about 45 bucks. $45. Can't beat that. Alright, so what do you do when you spend $45 at the Disney store? And that's the first store you go into. You come back to the parking lot and you drop all that crap off so you have to curiously so have more room to carry more toys. And you so, forget, and then you get to spend more money. Yeah, so you're not in the, oh, I just spent that much money. I shouldn't be, be buying anymore. Eh, out of sight, out of mind. So, I can't believe it. We got all that stuff for like 45 bucks. I got, what, three figures, the helmet, the uh, Pizza Planet truck. It should have been well over at yeah. least $200. That cooler bag cooler for like $12, $13 for that. We're going to use that for when we go back and forth to Indiana. That is like a perfect, just collapse it, keep it in the car. It's cute. Yeah, and if we need it, it's there. Because we're always trying to bring stuff back. My mom and stuff will make things and try to tell us to send it back, but we ain't got any cooler or anything to carry this stuff in. So this is going to be, that's going to be perfect. But mm -hmm. yeah, all that stuff. Seems like I'm missing something. Seems like there was something else too, but all that for $45. Oh, Peace Planet. Did you well, say? yeah, I yeah, just said that Peace Planet. We're not even done. We didn't hit Toys R Us. We haven't hit that main store we wanted to go to. Yeah, or the Hot Topic. So we're screwed. Yeah, we're screwed. <laughs> we're just not gonna eat for a couple weeks. It's all right. I just play. And then you got those things. You should give me a couple of those. You know? I don't know Panda. All right. Let's go spend some more money. Ouch. All right. Here goes the rest of my money. Let's go see what they got. I mean, people put their stuff in so I can see. Just glad I didn't see the Pizza Planet truck for cheap. They have a little pod heat they were in. I've seen that at the other Target. Where's too cute? I think it's, I don't think the, any of these prices are different than the regular. No. I've always wanted a Hot Wheel of my car that I'm driving, so I figure I just go get this and then go buy the Lamborghini to go with it. Yeah. Sounds like a good plan. <laughs> Oh, he's ready? Like a Dragon? 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 Go go Power Ranger and go 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 somewhere else. And they're selling all these at regular price. We can get most of those for like ten, fifteen dollars. Oh, they're sharing one or two. Phoenix. That's about it. There's 
still selling them for 50 bucks. Have to meet the guy to buy that for that price. And then they got the Star Wars. The regular peg warmers. Well, the outlet store is supposed to be cheaper, not the same or more. All right. And you only paid five dollars. Well, it's, it's smaller than the one that I got. It is. It's, like it's about cheaper. This, it's usually about this size. And it's thirty-five bucks, and I got the bigger, the bigger one for about six. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Don't really need that. Well, that was a major disappointment. Yeah, the huge disappointment. Yeah. At least we had Disney. All right, let's check out the Hot Topic one. See what it has. <laughs> Lilo. 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 Collects all the horror pops, especially the alien. She loves alien. I don't know if she has this one or not. I want to ask her. When she does, I guess I'll be getting this one. All right. Well, we're done with the uh, outlet store. Got a lot of stuff. Spent a lot of money there. And we're on the way to the Chesterfield Mall where the V stock is. But we ran into a Walgreens, so let's go see what they got first. Gotta be kidding me. And this is where all the money blows. Why'd you have to stop here? Why did you have to stop here? I'm definitely getting here. I don't really need her, but... Let's see what else they got. I can't believe they... They had those. I don't see anything else. Let's walk around a little bit and see what else they got. Old man Logan. Oh, who's that? Shatter Star. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. What else they got? Oh my gosh, Sunfire? <laughs> oh, there's Dazzler. It's the first time I've seen any of these in the store. Got them. Yeah, I got all those already. Oh my gosh. This. Oh. oh my gosh. You see all those 
oh my gosh I haven't seen any most of those figures in the store at all and those are some like from like a year or two ago figures um if if I had the money wasn't heading out to V stock I probably would have picked up a good majority of them and try to build the uh, the Hulk Buster at least that would be a good start but I limited myself to one so of course I had to get War Machine it's a no brainer there um oh that would just I don't know that's just cool but then I would have been kicking myself trying to find all the other ones and I just don't need that so stuck with War Machine so Iron Man will have an actual good buddy I'm going to pose these guys together that's going to be pretty cool really cool so as we were on the V-Stock alright well we made a favorite store in the whole wide world or at least in this area let's go see if they got any more cool stuff
All right, so we're going to wrap up this video and go over a lot of the stuff that I got uh, for the past week, and mostly from this weekend. One of my finds, um, of course, from the Disney store, picked up this awesome mask, or helmet, I should say, more than it is a mask. It, um, I find it. Yeah, it lights up, does a voice changing, you know, the Death Trooper pretty good mask uh, not sure what it retails for the uh, $34 right there $34 for this death trooper helmet and I got it for a whopping six bucks couldn't pass that up could not pass I don't think it's a full one I didn't want to take it out just yet until I did this video I think it probably doesn't have a back and uh, that's good that's fine. Also, uh, Saturday, picked these up at Target. Couldn't I love Son of Zorn, the show. I wouldn't say love, but I watch it. It's pretty good. And they have the look of a He-Man and Master of the Universe type thing. The show's pretty funny. I like it. That's why. That's the main reason why I got them, not because they look like Master of the Universe. I think that's what it's supposed to be based off of. But look awesome. And then, of course, everybody loves Rick and Morty. I really wish they would have had Rick. Somebody already grabbed him. They had Birdman and uh, uh, somebody else. I can't remember. And But they had they had him. So I went ahead and picked him up. Hopefully, I'll find Rick pretty soon. And that was... See, I didn't, uh, I didn't get to record a lot of Saturday because my, my film... Or my... Sorry. I don't know. My uh, phone ran out of memory because we were out so long recording stuff. It's a 250 gig phone and it's maxed out with stuff that I got. So while we were there at the outlet mall, of course I picked up uh, this pop, uh, Hot Topics exclusive face hugger on whoever that is, worm, I guess. Again, I don't really collect pops. I got this for my wife. She loves the horror type pops especially the alien or predator so that's for her and uh saturday morning i made a deal uh, a couple weeks ago with a local guy who tries to sell stuff but not having much luck but he offered to sell me a case that he ordered uh for 120 dollars for the whole case and he opened it up and the case came with um, K2SO and Krennic. And I asked him if I could get all of them but those two and he said that's fine. So I got the following figures for exactly $20 each. Quick one, Jen. Lando. The Sand Trooper. And the Royal Guard cannot beat that price. You can't even get these online for cheaper than probably $30 right now. And I got them for a cost at 20 each, no tax, no shipping, nothing. So I'm very, very happy with these. Very happy with these. So, while we're at the Disney store, I'm just going to keep going back and forth because I got so much in the area. I picked up these figures. The three figures for again six dollars a piece so we got bays Bodhi, and chirrut six dollars a piece since these guys are so hard to find in the black series i have bays in the black series but i do not have chirrut still having issues finding chirrut for a decent price He's available now at a decent price at a couple spots, but uh, just the money-wise right now, kind of went crazy, and about to put myself on a budget. So those will be filling in the Black Series spot. And then while we we're at Toys R Us, picked up this because it was only three dollars. So I went ahead and picked it up. Didn't really, I mean, I like it. But if it wasn't for three dollars, I probably wouldn't have picked it up. But hey, I can't pass up three dollars. And then also, 
had hit the pizza planet truck could not pass that up that is just awesome i believe we paid full price for that sucker but i don't really care i thought that was so cool that the pizza planet truck has its own vehicle and i guess he's in cars three todd pizza planet uh, we'll see that movie eventually uh, a couple weeks ago i ordered a uh death star commander figure online and the uh off of ebay and it came right there and the package was kind of damaged so the card got bent and this is the only one that i've gotten in the second wave so far i ordered a couple of uh, jawas which i gotta check and see where those are at because these were the cheapest that i could find on ebay it was like twenty dollars with a five dollar shipping and the same with the uh, the jawas so i ordered those too so hopefully those guys will come in and i'll have luck with finding the rest of them and after we left the uh um outlet mall stopped at a walgreens and boom found the hulk buster or uh, yeah hulk buster build a figure war machine figure. i have not seen this guy in the wild at all i'm probably seeing everywhere now that i found him but they had that Walgreens. I tried to take pictures, but again, I, like I said, my phone um, ran out of memory. So I don't know why it didn't. Or I might have just messed it up. But I took a bunch of pictures because they had a lot of older figures like that from that wave and a couple other waves that I really wanted to get. But I had to limit myself because we hadn't made it to V-Stock yet. Which is kind of ironic because we didn't even buy anything at V-Stock. So, actually we didn't buy anything in that whole mall when we got there. And then last night, while we're grocery shopping, I found the Guardians of the Galaxy 2 second wave. It was pretty much all of them. And a bunch of the Homecoming wave figures. So I had a decision to make on what I wanted to get. So I ended up picking up the Vulture and the little Cosmic Spider-Man dude. I'm trying to get the, uh, the wings. And my lighting in this room is just bad. I'm sorry, guys. But the, uh, I'm only missing two, two figures. Of course, Moon Knight. I think everybody's missing him. And then number five. Can't read what his name is, but yeah. So I'm missing those two. I thought I was only missing one, Moon Knight, but I saw something online and I was like, oh, I don't think I have that guy. And I do not. So I need those two to finish the wings. And then... He will be beautiful once more. But that is majority of what all I got. Not including my Loot Crate and Bam Box that I got this weekend too. Loot Crate, um, if you want to see what was in that, go to Dark Collector's site. And uh, I put a link to his, his videos in my last video. He uh, did a uh, opening box review on that loot crate. Wasn't too crazy about that. But the BAM box, we got um, Nacho Libre Mask. I'm not putting that on for you guys. Sorry. Got the patch from the Goonies. Some of you probably like this. Got an autographed Power Rangers, original Red Ranger picture. And it has a certificate of authenticity with that. And, of course, it came with a couple more pictures on the E.T. And here's an original art picture. It's pretty cool. It's actually even numbered and signed by the artist. So, I think, I think I've seen that artist around before. And it came with a Batman journal where it looks like the skin of his suit. And the first dozen pages or so are, like, filled out. Supposed to be him taking notes on a case. It's supposed to be like an original type story or something. It's like the first dozen pages. So that's pretty cool. And uh, of course the pin. Most of these boxes they have to come in a pin. It's like a zombie thing. So if these type of items look uh, good for you. Like you might want. 
check out the BAM box. They're, uh, they always come with autographs and props and stuff. They've had like Jason masks signed by the guy who played Jason a couple times. An actual machete signed by the guy who played Jason. And I just happened to get in there and got a mask for Nacho Libre. Yay. But I did get notified uh, today, a little bit ago, through uh, Twitter, that I had won a Daredevil comic book that was autographed. I'm not sure who autographed it. So we'll see what happens there. If it comes before my next video, I'll, I'll kind of show that off too. But yeah, that is my haul. <laughs> Quite a bit. This is what happens when your wife is out of town for a long period of time. You kind of go crazy on the toys. So, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't done that yet. Like, comment, all that stuff. I like to hear from you guys. I like chatting with you. Check out the other people um, that comment. Most of the people who comment have their own videos too. So, check them out. And uh, really need to get more subscribers. Some of these YouTubers, they get, they're on there for like a month and they already got like almost a thousand people. I just broke 33 and I've been doing this for what, a couple months now. So, I'm not feeling the love too much. But, yeah. Big old haul here. Now that I did the video, I can open it up and start playing. Alright, thanks for watching. Happy hunting and we'll see you next time.